Hi, Brianna. <laughs> what? She's got to get to work. Hey, hi. You didn't notice you. Hey, get your feet out of my seat there. Wet feet in my seat. No good. Boo. Good morning, everybody. Nice thumbs. Um, hip hugger, Ryan. Good morning to you. And All also, right. don't forget, get donuts for Donut Dash. The donut. The donut. Hey, because it's the Circle City Donut Dash. The Circle City Donut Dash coming up the 17th of February. Margaret, thank you to Benefit Teachers Treasures. Look at all the thumbs coming right now for this. Running walking event features a donut challenge option and sweet treats like an awesome Circle City Donut Dash 5K t shirt. So much more to Benefit Teachers Treasures. We love you, Margaret, and Teachers Treasures. We love our teachers, don't we, Lainey Lou? And also, what I was doing this morning is I had a donut, and what I decided to do is I eat it. And then I went to the donut. So we had, what she's trying to say is we had a real donut, and then we have a stuffed donut, too. And I ate the donut. And you ate the, the real donut and left the stuffed pillow-like donut. Good morning, Ian. Good morning, Darnell. Eric, Tyler. Good morning, buddy. Lainey's getting my seat wet. I don't like it. Boo. All right. What else do you <laughs> What else do you want to add? I don't see anyone. Heath Bartlett is hoping for a Bloomfield upset of number one Tenley Saturday. The girls' regional at Southwestern Shelby. Hasn't Tenley been rolling up like 106 to, to like three scores and things like that? So good luck to Bloomfield too. Um, Darnell, good morning to you. Mike Cody, good morning. Oladipo for MVP. Jennifer, good morning to you. All right, Victor Oladipo is the, and I've said this before, the most valuable player when it comes to or in terms of being with or without his team in the NBA. And listen, you can say, well, you're just defining that to, to make your argument. Exactly. That's my definition of it. You can't, because here's the deal. You take Oladipo off the Pacers, and they, they don't win 15 games on the season without Oladipo, do they? Do the Pacers win 15 games without Oladipo? I mean, you take anybody else away from any other team, and they don't look as discombobulated like they've not played basketball ever in their life. Like the Pacers do without Victor Oladipo. That's it. Tim Lawrence says this. Ran cross country in college on our six mile easy days. We would eat donuts before the run. Go donut days. There you go. Uh, Hip Hugger says that Newkirk shouldn't start anymore. <laughs> hey, we got, hey, there's Ian right there. Hi, Ian. <laughs> He's watching. They're watching right there next to us. That's pretty awesome. <laughs> that is awesome. Say hi, Lainey. Hello. Say hi to him. Uh, Ian's right next door to us in the car. Good. Can you see us, Ian? Hey. Hip hugger, I am ready to teach IU how to shoot free throws. All right, all it is, line, line your foot, your guide foot up with the nail in the floor at the basket, three knee bending dribbles after an exhale of holding the ball over the front rim, 85%, I'll have these guys at 85% in literally a week. 85% in a week, I count on it. Good morning, Gordon. Hello. Good morning, John and Laney. Uh, Ryan asked this, I'm afraid the whole GR3 return could be, well, I, uh, anticlimactic. I, I could see that too. Um, I could see that too. They need anything right now. They, there is such a thin line. I mean, really, when they lose anybody, then they're in trouble because they just don't have enough around them. But Oladipo, no. there is nobody, nobody that's been more valuable to their team this year than Victor Oladipo. Why can't national people figure this out? I mean, I've been telling you this for how long? I mean, national people can't figure it out, ever. Okay, we don't need any more. Good morning, Faze. Very, very cute, man. Thank you. Thank you, Derek Martin's watching. Uh, Michael Speaker's watching. I got a donut dash all the time. I got a donut right here. Good morning, Kevin. All right, what else do you want to talk about here, lady? Jason Monday's watching, too. Huh? Nothing else? Tyler Cox says, I can't wait to see Victor in the All-Star game. You want to hear Rage Against the Machine? Is it too early for Rage Against the Machine? All right, you pick. We're going to have, we're going to do something right now. Laney is going to pick 
the music. All right, I'm going to let you pick it, okay? We're, we're going to be surprised. Lainey gets to pick the music. Are you ready? Yeah. Lainey, you pick right now. Hey, by the way, Josh McDaniels News, what did I tell you about getting Florio'd? I mean, it was just straight Mike Florio, grease back, lawyer, can't stand the Colts, hates Jim Irsay, <laughs> ball crap is what it was, as always, man. He's trying to get you Florio'd. Aren't you glad you have me here to tell you that you can't get Florio'd? You don't want to get Florio'd. This is you? Yes. Ed Sheeran? You like this song? Lady likes Ed Sheeran. <laughs> it's a risky one. I got, hey Heath, I got Ed Sheeran out of it. That's what I got. Shape of you. You like this song? I'm not making fun of your music. Don't get sad. Also, why I wasn't in the video yesterday is because I had the knot in my hair. <laughs> explain, wait, 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 wait. You can't explain what you just said. Because you weren't in the video yesterday because you had a knot in your hair. Explain. Can you explain that? No, you have to explain that. She had a knot in her hair. I think it's because of the way her dad combs it in the morning. Because uh, cause, uh, Christy is in Chicago for the next three days. So I am doing everything um, alone. And I can't, I mean, it, as you see, I can't do a darn thing with hair. Nothing. Girl's hair. I mean, look, I can do my own like crazy. Look at that. Woo! That looks great. I can do that. But when it comes to Lainey's hair, I can't do a darn thing. If he gets it too loud. <laughs> Good morning, Aaron. <laughs> Michael! Matt! Good morning! What are you doing? Don't do that. Man. A knot in your hair? So Ed Sheeran. All right. Ed Sheeran was what Lainey picked. You want to pick something else really quick too? Yep. You guys got any questions? Go ahead. Um, I would expect McDaniels to be announced later on today. Press conference tomorrow as I told you yesterday. We'll okay, see close your eyes everyone. Everyone, close your eyes. <laughs> Gordon says we love hats, man. I do too. Uh, she's got to wear more. I mean, look at this right now. I can't do anything with I Nothing with it. Good morning, Chaz. That's the one I chose. I closed my eyes. You want Tom Petty? You closed your eyes and got Tom Petty radio. Yes. All right. I like Tom Petty. Matt Taylor would like this if you were watching right now. Good morning, Aaron. Good morning, John and Lanny playing Mr. Mom for the next couple of days. I am, man. Okay. I am. And then this. Selena Gomez on the Pitbull channel. Black Crows, she talks to angels. This is not going well for the morning soundtrack. Um, oh, you turn that. Ooh, we got Kenny Loggins on two different channels here, Lainey. Loggins and Messina, and then Loggins. 70s and 80s dominated by the Logman. The Logman's dominating this morning. You gotta love it. Um, Moose is your hair taming friend. Can I put Moose in your hair tonight? Hey. No, 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 no. Hey. No, no, no. Can I no, play? No, no, no. Can I play no, the no. air synthesizer? <laughs> uh, Caddyshack song. Yeah, we had Loggins. We were Loggins dominated a moment ago. Uh, Matt wants to know who's your early pick to win the Super Bowl next year, Laney? Who is it? Um, you got to get on camera. You're off camera. Who's going to win the Super Bowl next year? Come here, tell them. Um, what football team wins the Super Bowl? What team I want to be on the Super Bowl next year is going to be. Yes. Um, Rick Clark, good morning, buddy. Hope you're feeling better. Mark? Um, the Dolphins. The Dolphins, Laney says. Laney wants the Dolphins to win the Super Bowl next year. My pick to win the Super Bowl next year has to be the Dolphins. I'm going to go with the Rams. Year two of McVeigh, I'm going to go with the Rams next year. How do you like them apples? The Rams. That's my early pick to win. I don't even know. Are they, what are the Vegas odds in the Rams, lady? Wait, what does T.Y. mean? What does T.Y. Huh? mean? Ask Rick. I don't know what it means. Rick, what does it mean? Darnell says Purdue, Virginia, Nova, and Michigan State. Final four right there, D. Man, I hope Purdue goes to the final four because the fans won't be able to. Won't be able to hack it. Um, 
Bob Chambers likes the pick of the Dolphins. Nobody likes my Rams pick. Hey, Butler Xavier later on tonight. That should be a good one from Hinkle Fieldhouse. Butler needs to get a little bit of payback. Nine, oh. ten, means. Rick, Rick Clark means T.Y. means thank you. Thank you. That's Val. That's Val Clark's dad. Rick, you know Rick. Once you get up and start doing Hey, stop. This is going to be an unfortunate pose here. Stop. Stop it. Um, what else we got? Anything else? We want to make fun of Florio a little bit more. And his chatter. <laughs> the chatter. That's awesome. I told you, don't get Florio'd. Florio hates the Colts and hates Ursay. Um, and he, any dig he can get, he'll get a dig in his greasy morning. lawyer hair. Morning. Any dig. Good morning, Diane. Say hi, Diane. Good morning, Diane. Hey, look. Good. With my mallet finger, I can play the air synthesizer. Watch. Hey, Let's try a wallet. Put oh, my wallet down. What? No, 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 no. All right. What else we got here? Final questions. <laughs> Florio, speaker. I told you, Florio. Robert Murray says X by 10. Do you think Xavier's going to beat Butler? I don't know why my fingers are doing Huh? I don't know why my fingers are doing <laughs> You can't play the, the air synthesizer. My friend Brad Hosclaw was always really good at this. Say hi, Brad Hosclaw. Hi. Brad Holtz Club was really good. He, except he would do it on the dashboard. Uh, Darnell, what do you got? Dinner for carry out the next few days. All right, here's what we got going tonight. We've got Noodles and Company. we got a split. US 31 South, Noodles and Company for mac and cheese for Blake. And Lainey wants to go where, Lainey? Tell them where you want to go. Come here. Jaggers. Jaggers. Mick Jaggers. Okay. Big what? win by the dogs tonight, Diane. All right, what's this? Lost Eddie's hit, lady. Shh, shh, shh. Lost Eddie's hit. Another auditory jam. Uh-oh. Time to go! Okay, let's see. Leo, I don't really want to hear any Leo say or do. Let's see if you guys can see stuff more closer. Because I need to see these. I'm going to see if you guys can see stuff more closer. Bob Chambers, IU versus Notre Dame baseball April 17th. Victory field tickets, five bucks. What a value. That sounds pretty fun. Hey, my friend Kurt. Kurt's down in Jasper. Are you Kurt? Are you in Jasper, Columbus? I can't okay, remember. Okay, everybody, bye. <laughs> Kurt, EG, I saw where uh, Eastern's football coach is going to Evansville North. Go. I think we all expected that. I saw that, Kurt. Darnell, I am not cooking. I've already cooked. I cooked yesterday. Tell us if you like gum. gum. Bubble yum, Laney. Ask about their favorite old school gum. Kurt is in Jasper. That's what I thought. I don't know why Here's Kurt. I brought up something else. Gum. Jasper. Here's the For some reason, I thought you might have been in Ferdinand, but what? Here's the Let me have this really quick. Hold on. All right. For those of you that love bubble gum, if you had a choice between Bubblelicious versus gum. There's Ian. Hi, Ian. Bubblelicious versus Haba Baba or Bubble Yum. What would you chew? Bubblicious, hubba I bubba, choose, or choose, bubble yum. I would choose neither because I hate gum. Gordon says juicy fruit. There's Matt Hicks. Hey, Matt, hurry up and get back on Sundays, all right? Hurry so up. Said bubble yum. Tell John to get back. So I said bubble yum. Good morning, Pete. Bubs. Bubble yum and juicy fruit. Hubba bubba was no stick. Thanks for this candy bar. No, that's mine. Hey, 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 hey. Bubble Yum's getting a lot of votes. So we got Bubble Yum. All right. Hey, tell everybody bye. Hey, remind the uh, Circle City Donut Dash the 17th of February for Teachers Treasures. We love our teachers. Love you, Margaret. Later on today, Matt Hasselback's going to join me, former Colts quarterback. We're going to ask him about luck, ask him about McDaniels. We're going to ask him about everything. Matt Hasselback's on the show later on today. Uh, Rick Venturi joins the show later on today in the 5 o'clock hour. And that's bye -bye. Greg, going to join us as well. You guys are awesome as always. Bye. On behalf of Laney and I, thank you for watching Drop Off Line Sports. Give us some thumbs. Have a great day. Talk to you in three. Chris Stapleton tickets, by the way, too.